hello guys welcome again in this video we are going to learn how i can use annotation and uh, by using annotations how can how i can remove these bean tag and uh, for implementing setter and constructor injections so uh, first of all just i make this comment here and I make this tag comment first one I'm not making this comment because I need these data for constructor injection but I'm just removing this one because I will set the property in the class so I just save it in a car if I put here like component remember that I'm just using here component and automatically this car become beans so doesn't require to enter in this xml file why because i make it bean to make a bean we have to make it component and for initializing a value you see that i'm initializing a value here honda city and this value so i am initializing this value here like this value i say honda city same again here also i am just using the model 2021 like this and i save it done this one completed now i go to bike here and uh, here in bike what i do i just put here the component like this and I save it and you see the constructor is here and I need to provide value here so I say it auto wire like this that means uh, by you by writing here auto wire and make it component as a bean so it will get the value from here so it will get the value from this XML file so uh, this is the implementing the setter injection and this is for implementing the constructor injection by using this file but uh, how the uh, your uh, xml file will uh, recognized that that uh, this car is a bean i told you that i have to insert this as a component but how it will search by the configuration file that we have put the uh, uh, component tag in front of a class so this information can be get but how it will recognize the car for that I have to use a tag here context and in this I have to say component scan and here in the base package I have to give the base package where my class are available so I just put the value and what is the meaning of this tag that it will automatically scan all the classes under this package those having this annotation component if like car have a component that means this configuration file will recognize car as a bean if we have a bike here we have bike as component then automatically it will recognize it's a bean and here you see i'm using our car id because i have given the id here here and here also but now I am removing this one because automatically with the name of the class it will recognize doesn't need to use any ID here so here is the same configuration file we are we are getting a beans also but I am not using this time ID these ID I am not using because automatically when I add the component here it become uh, beans and with the help of car dot class it will recognize that this is a bean this will also recognized so this value will come from here there is a honda city and uh, uh, if i uh, change the name of the car you will re recognize the values coming here i say maruti a shift and i save it okay so in place of honda city i just give maruti shift and here uh, 
here also I am using the auto wired so it will get the uh, initialization from here Honda sign and this one in a bike and if I run this time you see I will have the value Maruti switch shift like this and Honda sign so this information I am getting where I am getting from here so this is also the way to make a setter injection and constructor injection by using the annotation this component annotation and here I am not using bean tag for car I am using here uh, tag for uh, bike also but I am not using this object I am using the same object here this one this one this beans I am using and I have told the auto wired means if there is a value available for the constructor then value should come here so it will search the constructor value from this place and it will link with this object so that's all in this video uh, to make a you can say the setter and and constructor injections by using annotation and uh, if you like this video kindly do subscribe my channel and thank you for watching this video